How's everyone doing today? Um, what you're looking at right now is my hand, which uh, if the person I'm about to illustrate was here, they'd probably call it ashy or crispy for uh, its you know dark complexion. I have decided to draw the one and only true YouTube personality, Cynthia G. Let's get started. Now, just like Tariq Nasheed from last time, you start off with a circle, but this one actually doesn't have to end up being perfect because even though Cynthia G is a perfect person, I mean, just whew, she gets out of bed, she has all, you know, she just looks wonderful. Um, you know, ah, terrific. So you start drawing the eyes and you have to give them a little space in between, you know, enough distance to uh, capitalize on the fact we're going to have to start getting into this hair sooner than later. This real hair that she has uh, give a you know the nose a little bit of a, a pump type feeling now you, you usually don't darken in the nose but I'm gonna break some rules here okay and I'm gonna extend the overall length of the bottom part of the face now let's start giving her those those lips those you know so attractive and so appealing lips those lips that you know, are just so enticing to me as a male. Those lips that when I go to sleep at night, I think of uh, kissing them or, you know, having some involvement with them in one form or another. Now you start doing the eyes. And this I actually, I, I messed up, guys. I, I did a banged up job right here. I, I should have done a little bit more to correct my mistake here, which is to create some shading on top for that you know for that for that uh, that little makeup that um she admittedly wears I mean the rest of it is real like this real hair that goes up to the top and we also have to do her real eyelashes or eyelash that is visible now we're gonna do her trademark what would you go a bang bang over over top bang over the head I guess so Okay. Let's let's make her face a little bit more angular, more um more straightened out. Okay. We're starting we're starting to kind of see the basic look of this person. It's it's really good. You really you really get this idea of this strong, powerful woman on YouTube, this this speaker against the oppression of the white male. Man. I'm feeling passionate just talking about it right now. Okay. Now, there's one other thing that I'm leaving out here and that you guys can pick and choose if you want to include it. Her hair actually is multiple colors. So, you know, you can make it a little bit lighter as you get down here and not as dark as the top to sort of cement the fact that, again, it is different shades. But that's really up to you because she has, and um, I think as far as I can remember, had it at different colors. I'm not sure. Those hidden colors, as my man Tariq Nasheed would say. So yeah, you make it a little a little lighter up down here. And now this is another optional thing you can do. Um, in a lot of her videos, she'll have her hair in a certain way to where you can see um, these you know these wonderful earrings of hers. So I'm gonna draw some right now. And you have, you have to make sure they're they're very long and wide, long enough for you know, these little hoopty hoop earrings, long enough for you to throw a basketball through all right and that should be it so yeah um only mistake I think I've made is making the chin a little dark um, which you know she would again call crispy and putting my hand in, ca in the camera again which you know this excuse me for my you know my dark skin my, my crispy hand so yeah that, that guys that's how you draw Cynthia G um, remember Lots of makeup, lots of real hair, and no crispiness.